hello everyone uh, in this video i will show you how we can create uh, workflows in zoho crm for or automatically follow up from our customers let's suppose we send an initial email to our customer from zoho crm and uh, if they do not reply or do not respond to our email we want to send a follow-up email automatically let's suppose after three days of initial email and if they still do not reply we want to send another follow-up email after seven days or after one month or 15 days whatever uh, time period suits your business and uh, if they do reply we want to stop the uh, upcoming scheduled follow-up so we will discuss all this in uh, in this video so before starting if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe so you can see more video like this okay so i am going to create a workflow uh, you will go to the settings and workflow rules and from here we will create a new rule and uh, whatever modules you want to uh, create the workflows for we are going to uh, make this uh, rule for the workflow for the leads module and our requirement is uh, that whenever a new lead came we will send an initial email to the customer we have already created some workflows or oh, sorry some email templates for them and uh, if they do not reply after three days we will send a first follow-up and if they still do not uh, uh send reply or response we will send an another email after seven days so i am going to give it name uh test uh, workflow initial plus um, follow up okay so this is our workflow and when we are going to create on whenever a lead is uh, is going to create it is totally up to your business requirement how you want and whatever the conditions are here so what i am going to do let me tell you one thing i have created we have three types of contact in our uh, scenario for for our lead there are three types of con uh, contact trustee owner attorney and lender attorney so we uh, want to send an email all of them uh, uh, in in the video i will show you just for one of them and uh, this is uh, a checkbox field i have created uh, when this checkbox will automat automatically check i will also let you know how we can uh, track the response or the if the customer reply to our email this field will be automatically checked and if this field is checked then zoho crm will not send any further follow-up emails okay so my conditions are here is if lead matching matching certain condition so my condition is if uh, trusty email response is not selected next uh, sorry there is another condition we have to create and uh, lead type i'm going to show you why i choose this lead type is we have different types of lead and based on that lead we have a different email template so if we have uh, this type of lead we will going to use another email template and if we have a different email template then we will select the uh, different lead type we will select the different email template for them okay so uh, if and whenever a new lead come we will going to send them an initial email email notification and from here we i have already created this email templates and the notification we are going to send this initial email and then i will schedule uh, like uh, for the follow-up emails i say that after three days this if this checkbox is not selected then after three days it will send another follow-up one email and again if uh, after 
seven days. This means that after seven days of uh, lead created of the initial time. So after three days, this email will be sent and after creating of the deal, after seven days, this email uh, follow up, second follow up email will be sent to the customer. Okay, so but if they do respond to our email, this checkbox, this checkbox will will be automatically selected. We will also create a workflow for this, and uh, when this checkbox will be checked, these casual email will be stop sending to to the customer because every time whenever a schedule email is going to send, it always check these conditions in the workflow if the condition met only then the email schedule e email will be sent to the customers okay i'm going to create a second uh, condition if let's suppose if the lead type is different than this one then we are going to send another type of email templates so my condition will be same trusty email uh, sorry trusty email response is not selected it means uh, we still did not yet receive the response and the lead type is not this one i mean for this lead type we are going to send this these email templates and if it is not bankruptcy then we are going to send different type of email templates maybe in your business you don't do not have such requirements but in in our case we have this requirement so we will going to one more condition i am going to add here that we have the trusty email obviously when we have the email address on then we can send the email but if the email address is empty we cannot uh, proceed the, with the workflow so I am going to put a condition is not empty same for the above email uh, trusty email is not empty done okay for this I am going to for the initial email this will be this one uh, associate and schedule is the same first one first follow-up after three days <clears throat> oh, sorry uh, and this next one is uh, not here add another schedule after seven days this one this is okay so our workflow is set up to send the automatically follow-up emails so our next step is i'm going to save this workflow so our next step is let's suppose customer do uh, customer response to our email let's suppose the initial email then we do not want to send the follow-up emails anymore so for that what uh, I, i'm going to create another rule uh, which will be on the email module and rule name is uh, lead or the customer response received okay for for uh, for this uh, to uh, see if we have received the response of the customer we are going to select outbound email and in the outbound email we will send the specific email uh, that we are going we are sending to the customer in the workflows uh, as a follow-up or as an initial email so outbound email is sent or we will say outbound email is replied it means when someone replied to the outbound email we send to them whenever someone replied the zoho crm will trigger that reply and based on that trigger we will update the field that we re receive the response 
and we will check that checkbox and it will not send the follow-up emails anymore for that particular lead okay so replied next in here we are going to select yes uh, would you like to set conditions for email fields yes i have given a unique uh, subjects to to the email that i'm going to send automatically using the workflows so i will say uh, that if the email subject is or contains i have put something a unique value in the email subject which was bk uh, bkt which one which means the bk trusty email so if that value is contained in the email subject and we receive the reply for that email the outbound email we send then we apply this rule to leads we send the follow-up emails for the leads for we, so we will select here lead then next uh, we will update the field which is uh, we will create a new update <coughs> our field name was trusty response received yes so whenever trusty will reply this person this contact will reply to our email that we send them as initial or the first follow-up this checkbox zoho crm will trigger and it will update this checkbox here i have already created this field which is this one i'm going to use this okay so this is i created for uh i have to create it two uh, one is for uh, bankruptcy type leads and another one is so i'm going to change it any the second one was for fcl or other than uh, bkt and for that uh, email templates i have given them a different subject and uh, which was FCLT. So you have to be uh, put something value or you need to create your email subjects unique from the others emails you are going to send from the CRM. Uh, so you can uh, later trigger them in the workflows that uh, we receive the response for the specific type of emails. So any of them condition when true either we receive the reply for bk type uh, leads or uh, other than bk type leads it will trigger and uh, it will update the response field here so we will save this i have already test these workflows and they are working pretty fine uh, i um, tried not to reply the email and it sends all the workflows and uh, then I tried to reply to one of the email and uh, it stopped uh, sending the scheduled follow-ups. Thank you, everyone. If you have any questions, you can ask me on the directly on my email or on, on the comments. Thank you.